hello everyone hope you are all doing great so you already see the preview of the template and now i'm going to show you how to edit and use the template after you open the template you see the current logo animation okay first we need to import our own logo but one important thing here is your logo must have a transparent background to work on this template i right click here go to import and file and i select my logo and press import then you can see there is a folder which name is edit and inside the folder there are two com logo placeholder and slogan text i double click the logo placeholder com to open it and i turn off the present logo and drag and drop the new logo you can see that there is a message which said put your logo above this line so we need to put our logo above this white line but first we need to scale down the logo so i press s to bring the scale and scale it down make it 50 no 45 okay then i bring it up and if we go back to the render com we see that our new logo is loaded then changing the slogan text to change it double click the slogan text com you can write any text you want i just write a random text you can also change the font and if you need then change the scale okay you see that the slogan text is updated okay then about changing the setting you can see there is a layer called control and if you select the layer and go to the effect control you see that there are several settings the first one is logo position and from here you can change the position of the logo bring it down or up then the slogan text position you can also change the slogan text position then the particle color okay for this logo i select a bluish particle color because it match with the logo color okay and then slogan text color i also select a light bluish okay looks good then there is background color one and background color two background color one is this overall black color and background color two is this faded color from top so i keep the first color as black but change the second color to a dark purple you can see that the color is already changing okay and the last setting is floor texture position you can also change the floor texture so let me show you if you change this value you can see that the floor texture is moving and the texture is actually limitless so you can change it until you find a base setting for you okay guys so this is how you edit the template and now the template is ready to render thank you everyone